Between 2005 and 2006, over 200 big game animals were killed on highways in the southern portion of Fremont County. Slow down, first of all, because most of the accidents can be avoided at a slower speed better than they can. Even if, it, if it's a posted speed limit at 65, you can still avoid an accident at 55 much easier. In addition to slowing down, you should also use extra caution at dawn and dusk. Once you see a deer cross the highway, you probably don't have to worry about that deer anymore. It's usually not going to turn around and come back across the road in front of you, but be very careful because many times there will be as several other deer behind that one. The highway department places signs at locations where wildlife collisions occur frequently, but the best strategy for accident avoidance is for drivers to remain alert and observant. Basically, almost all animals will have some sort of a reflective eye shine, we call it, uh, that you can see at a fairly good distance. When a person does see deer in the headlights, we'd like them to, to dim their lights or flash their lights. If you do experience a run-in with wildlife, be sure and report it to Game and Fish or the Sheriff's Department immediately. In Fremont County, I'm Cheryl Lee for K2 News.